thank you for joining us today. Uh, let's talk about the new collection and the inspiration behind this new collection. Welcome to you, welcome to DDC, and once again in Milano for the Salon de Mobile. We have done this year something similar than the past. So we developed a few different products where the sofa is the main product of the collection. But what really new is uh, that we develop in the largest way the outdoor collection. Inside collection is the same than the other one. It's uh, the same in terms of quantity or uh, number of pieces. We have done two different sofas that has one just name because we try to give the impression to the feel of the new concept of system of sofas. They are two different sofas, but they are ensemble together, giving two different kinds of seats, one with cushion and the other without. So that's why we call the two different sofas with just one name. It's a, something like a system composed by, mixed by two different uh, typology of sofas. Uh, on side of this, we have done uh, the armchairs, different armchairs, uh, tables, low tables, high tables, chairs for the dining table, dining table too drawers, uh, chest of drawers, uh, cabinets, and the collection is done with uh, the same attitude of the years past. We have already had two collections for the outdoor that are done with uh, polypropylene net. It's a synthetic uh, material. It's a performing material for the outside. What we were looking for this year with giving the impression of the biggest collection for the outdoor, it was to put in the catalog a system made by wood because wood is the ancient uh, idea of the outdoor collection, the outdoor furniture is the ancient idea of performing material. So we use uh, uh, this wood uh, that's called Iroko. We use this wood in, to make uh, a classic, uh, modern, uh, very charming uh, outdoor collection. We have done uh, with two different finishing. One is natural, it's a little lighter than the other one. And the, one, the other one is uh, painted, painted, colored, colored in the darker way than the, the other one. Can you say this year that the fabric comes first? and then the design of the furniture? Sometimes we start from the fabric to develop the shape of the sofa. Sometimes it's the kind of fabric we decide to develop to suggest us in which side, which way we have to draw the sofa. For example, this year we start thinking on a different a way to, to tailor the cover, the, 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 the cover. We start to think about a different way from the, what is usual on the sofa market. We start to think about the fashion tailoring. We decide to try to use a different way to, so, uh, so I don't know how you say it, uh, we have, we, when I said we, I mean uh, we not in the company, bought the right machine from the fashion industry to work on this fabric. And after then we choose and we develop fabric that became from the uh, fashion world. We use, uh, we start with uh, uh, men's fabric um, for men's fashion, men's um, dress, like a fresco di lana, um, bigunia, and we take the, 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 the fabric, the fashion fabric for example, but we uh, rebuild the structure of the fabric because the fashion fabric has a performance 
that is different. I mean, a jacket uh, is not so stressful like a sofa. So we need to make a structure on the fabric more stronger than what the fabric of a tissue or the fashion fabric has. So we start with the texture of the fabric. We start with the composition of materials of the fabric. And after that, we develop the right structure for the sofas. We have an idea about, uh, mm, yeah, just the shape. After then, working on the shape with uh, uh, particular detail on tailoring, we found um, not the shape. Uh, we found the. Um, I said the cover that gave us the idea to try to put together the two different sofas because one detail on the tailoring gave the DNA from the two sofas gave us the idea it's the common uh, the common um, uh, detail I don't know how you call it we said uh, comune denominatore fattore comune is a common part, a common detail that gave us the opportunity to mix the two different shapes. And just one detail, just one detail on tailoring makes the impression of a, a larger um, system. Conceptually, I've not seen it personally in the marketplace before that you have this one sofa, the common thread is the detail of the fabric. See? Then you do Quite a different aesthetic in, in a way from one block sofa to one sofa with the beautiful individual cushions. It's um, it starting to thinking to different customers, to different public, to different probably attitude of people. No, one is more um, bourgeois, the other one is more relaxed. No, the, the, the one with cushion is more bourgeois, is more for classic people, uh, uh, rational people. The other one is the younger people probably, or people more casual than the other one. We found at the end that the two different attitudes should be possible, was possible to combine, to mix it together because uh, uh, people should be suggested to be different in attitude with one uh, just one sofa so and we try to make a uh, two different identity two different uh, attitude together to give a suggestion to be different to be more free that's it that's a very clever, very clever. <laughs> <laughs> so then the the uh, smaller pieces in the range you you, you, you took existing product extended on that, you've done it really very successfully with regards to the, 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 the their sideboards and so on and so forth. Was that something which you, you every year, do you look at the back catalogue and decide, you know, that product there, we could really work with that and extend on that. Is that a very conscious decision for you? We love probably develop or enlarge probably a concept than one sofa or one typology of sofa. So we we develop in that way, not one product, but one one um, identity of product, one uh, concept of product. That's what we do. And Rodolfo, with all of these beautiful products, what would you like to see in your own home? This is difficult because um, I'm a little bit lazy in my, <laughs> in my house, but uh, I know that uh, I want to change something because I like on, to change uh, my point of view on it. Even because having a home gave me the idea or the suggestion to develop another concept because I'm trusting, I'm using, so, so depending. But at the moment I would like to change my sofa. Uh, I have a sofa, I mean, not a sofa at home, I would like to change it because, because I became tired, so I want to have something new. 
and I think that uh, the new one, the Freeman, should be a good um, possibility to change mine. It's a good alternative. That's it. You know, I know the Menotis. I'll have a chat with them. I'll get you a discount. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> good offer. Thank you so very much. Thank Always you to you. Pleasure. Thanks to you. Nice to to you. The last thing I have to say is I hope to come very fast to visit the IDICI in Australia. Please. Okay? That would be great. Would we'll be, be great. We'd we'll we'll be for me too. With very open arms. Yeah? Okay. Ciao. Fantastic. Grazie.